Hello and welcome to program three in this series of programs and tutorials designed to help you learn to program using TradeStation Easy Language. Um, if you're not part of our email mailing list, then please go to markplex.com. That's M-A-R-K-P-L-E-X.com. And uh, I'll be happy to let you know when I create new programs or tutorials. Um, now, program three is a program that is based on the work that we originally did back in tutorial 23. And uh, you may recall that tutorial 23 was all about creating a three line break indicator. Now, what you can see on the chart at the moment is TradeStation's three line break chart, which is uh, which is wonderful. And uh, now that is fine. But what we did in tutorial 23 is we created an indicator that effectively overlaid the uh, the lines or boxes or whatever you want to call them uh, on a normal using a normal indicator so for example you can see here a line of boxes well on a three line break chart that would just be represented by one uh, bar and the reason that we did this was it could potentially might be something that you would want to build into an indicator or show me or a strategy uh, that you're developing so what I've done in uh, in this program is really taken the code that was uh, developed in tutorial 23 and I've stripped out the ability to draw the boxes and what I've replaced it with is simply drawing a um, dot using the show me study so if we see the two together you'll see that we're drawing a dot at the start of the red bar an orange dot at the start of the red bar then we're plotting a white dot at the start of the green bars and so on. So for example um, in this program I haven't included the tutorial software so we should just turn that off and uh, you'll see what it looks like just using the uh, the show me study and uh, the rest of the code is basically the same um, apart from we just don't draw those boxes anymore. So I thought this might be a program that you might find uh, of use. If you do wish to download it I've included the uh, the code unprotected so you can look at it and uh, understand it and then apply that to some of your own uh, programs moving forward. Oh and incidentally just uh, you probably noticed there that uh, um, I've done this using the uh, the markplex colors of uh, blue and orange and so on and in order to get the uh, the down color of the orange I've used here a value of RGB and then the RGB component colors which uh, which you can do now rather than just using the standard trade station colors of red, green, cyan, light gray, dark gray, dark blue, etc. So anyway, um, I hope you might find this of use and uh, thank you for your attention.